Hi, I'm Jim Gamble. I'm here today to tell you about when I got started in the sport of swimming. I was about five or six years old when my father got me in the water. My father was an army vet and he wanted me to know how to swim at an early age. So he would take me to the local Orange YMCA where he was a member and that's where I got started in the water. A local swim coach there saw how well I was doing in the water and he approached my father and wanted to know if I wanted to join the swim team, which I was excited to do. And by the time I was eight years old, I was competing and got my first medal. I continued to swim from the ages of eight to 12 at the Orange YMCA where my father was a member. My mother remarried and we moved to Livingston when I was 12 years old. And fortunately, when we moved here to Livingston, I had a local Y, the West Essex Y, and I was able to swim for the Y team as well as my private school, Nork Academy. My sophomore year, I transferred to Livingston High School where I continued on the Livingston High School swim team as well as my local West Essex YMCA team. And I also swam for the town summer team where I am today. It was at the high school level that I realized that I wanted to swim at the division one level and I chose the University of Pittsburgh. In 1980, my freshman year at the University of Pittsburgh, I wanted to go there and be a freestyler. But unfortunately, there were much faster freestylers at the time. So I chose my second stroke, which was the breaststroke, where I swam all four years, the 100 breaststroke, the 200 breaststroke, and yes, my third event was the 200 IM. After my four years of swimming, I was offered the assistant coach position at the University of Pittsburgh, which I accepted. I continue to swim several times a week to this day, and I'm almost 58 years old. And I hope that my story inspires others to continue their swimming journey.